Today, we're going to talk about wills. And your initial reaction is, uh, I don't want to talk about it. Because what happens when we talk about wills? You think about wills and tie it to death and dying, and that's a subject that maybe you're not real comfortable with. It's okay. I understand. What I want to impress you with today is that your will is one of the most important documents you can put together and you can sign. Let me ask you, have you ever heard friends and colleagues say, oh, I don't need a will. Everything's going to go to my spouse anyway. Not true. When you die without a will, it's called dying intestate and you give the control of all of your assets over to the state you live in. You don't want to do that. You need to take the time to sit down with an attorney and put your will together. Think about it. What are your assets? Where do you want them to go? And oh, by the way, can we save a little bit on taxes when I pass away? And only a good attorney can help you with that. A good estate or will preparation attorney. Take the time and think it out. Here's a stat you might be interested in. Over 55% of Americans die without a will, according to CNN. That's an incredible number. Over half of us pass away without a will. Have you got your will put together yet? Hopefully you're not one of those stats, because that's what we're talking about today. Take some time and seriously think about putting your will together because the hot tip is, if you don't, you're going to give all that control to the state and you have little or no say because now you've passed away. Next time, we're going to talk a little bit about picking out a lawyer and how to interview lawyers to help you put your will together. But until then, there's a will, there's a way.